Hi friends, welcome to something of everything. In this video, we will learn about load combination generation, load combination manual addition, etc. Let us see the load cases. We have defined EQX, EQZ, DL, and L. There is one method of creating load combination. We can add defined combination. We can name the combination, add the basic cases to it, and add the factors the way you want, and add it. This is one load combination being created. As you can see, it's a combination. And these are the basic load cases. Okay, let's delete this. You can auto create the load combinations. Let us see how to do that. Go to auto load combination. Select the code, generate structure or still first, and generate the loads. It is generated the loads. As you can see, Let's understand what it has generated. The first combination that is 2.0.1.5 and 3.1.5. That means the load combination 1 is 1.5 DL plus 1.5 LL. 2 means load case number 2, 3 means load case number 3. 1.5 is the factorization of the basic load case. Then second load combination is 1.2 times dead load plus dead load. Third one is 1.2 times dead load plus live load plus EQX. Fourth one is 1.2 times dead load plus live load and minus EQX. Fifth one being 1.5 dead load. There should be a change in the basic load case. As you can see, there are 1, 1 EQX and EQZ. So we have to change that first. Go to input file, save the structure, and we go to log 1. As you can see, this is 1 and this is also 1. This can't be 1, this needs to be 2. As you are changing the basic load case number, this should not be same as the previous one. There can't be two load cases with the same number. Okay? So we have changed the numbers. Save the file. Close the input. You can see the load case has been removed. Now just click on add. Go to auto load combination. Indian and generate the load combination. There needs to be 13 to 14 load combination. And they are. You can create them repeat load cases. We will learn about repeat load cases in the next video. Just add this, and your load combinations are repeat. All you want to you can do is, as you can't understand general Indian code, generated Indian code, general structure one combination is which one. You have to double click on it, click on the name. And rename it as per the combination being generated. Change it. Okay. Then close it. Select another. Rename it one by two DL plus one by two L. Change it. Select third one. Rename it one by two DL. 1.2 LL plus 1.2 EQX. Okay, this is how you can change the names of load combinations. Let us see one more thing. Delete this all load combinations. These are standard load combinations. Right. Let's just delete this one combination again. Select and delete. delete. Click on let go space delete press yes delete yes delete yes delete yes repeat this 
for all the node combinations. Okay, let's learn the basic rules. How you can change the auto load combination rules? Auto loading and edit auto load rules. In which you can see that you can change the load combination rules for the structure category, or you can add new category for it. You can add the rows, update the table. These are the cases that you can generate. Let's say we don't want control file here. Just select it, delete it. You want to delete the first two? Yes. The rules has been changed. You can update the table and close it. Now when you create the auto load combination, select the Indian code and generate. As you can see, you can still getting the load case. Let's go to commands again. Loadings, edit auto node, code, Indian. And as you can see, there is no imperfect DL in it. Update the table, close it, save the structure. Then create the load cases. Let's see if it takes the correct one now. It still takes the one perfect idea. I think you need to close the structure and you open the structure. To make that rule work. This is all for load combinations. Thank you for watching us. Do like and share our videos and subscribe to our channel. If you have any doubts, Please mention it in comments so that we can solve it. Thank you for watching us.